Hello everyone, my name is Raxby and welcome back to the Ice Career Mode here on FIFA 16. We have a big match against Olympic Lyon here in the Europa League. As you guys may remember, last time around we did lose our match 3-1 away from home in the first leg. That does mean we need a 2-0 win here to still advance through to the semi-finals and I definitely want to try and make that happen so it's going to be tough but I'm going to go for it. Let's see if we can do it. Good attack now. Uh, let's give that wide out to Fisher. Can cut inside and take a shot here and uh, good save by Lopez. Good attack again. Fisher inside once more. Let's take another shot but that's blocked. Algazi gets through here. Very nice. Passes it off to Milik who needs to take a shot but it's blocked in the box good little pass through let's lay that off and this should be a goal and it is Al Ghazi puts in the 1-0 for us now five minutes before half time it's a good time to score we still have one entire half left to make our second goal here now and if we keep playing like we have been so far I think we can definitely do that okay time for the second half 45 minutes left to score one goal and get the 2-0 win we need to advance. Klaas now gives that true and that's a goal that's the 2-0 we need if it stays like this we are going through on away goals and I will happily take that. Great true ball here from Klaas with a great run from Bazura and he just smashes that into the top of the net. Keeper has no chance. Oh that's good by Goodell you know if we can get a goal here, no, because I played it out horribly. Still falls to Bazur though. Okay, Sisto, what can we do here? I just want to stay on the ball, honestly. Uh, can we cut inside? Oh, we can. That's good. Good pass through. And that's the 3-0 now. Now we're definitely going through. And we can even concede a goal and it will only go to extra time. So that's definitely good. Nice little run by Sisto, passes it to Gudelia and he's free in front of goal. He's going to score that any day. But there we go. We got a 3-0 win at home and convincingly go through anyway. First match in this uh, didn't go too well, but at home we get a convincing 3-0 win and we're through to the semi-finals of the Europa League. That nets us an extra 1 million of transfer budget, so that's lovely too. All right, we have a new scouting update. Um, Bram Brouwers, he looks pretty good, so I'll sign him up. Uh, I'll keep scouting those guys. You can be rejected. Ooh, you look very, very good. Mike, you are signed up. And I'll scout you a little bit longer too. All right, next up is our match away to FC Groningen. And as you guys may remember, we are still level on points with Feyenoord in the Eredivisie. So we need to keep winning our matches to make that happen and hope that Feyenoord drops some points. So let's get into it now. Van Rijn now true. Um, let's pass that and then take a shot. Ah, oh, sister, that's way too weak. Time for the second half now. I've been playing somewhat well the first half, but haven't really created any great chances yet um, but hopefully if I keep playing attacking and well uh, those will come and I can get the win that I really really want to get here oh Shane is true can he stay on the ball he can and he takes a shot and it goes in kind of a weird angle to score from I didn't think that would actually go in I was hoping for maybe a corner or a rebound but well he gets it in somehow and uh, you know what? I will take that. I will very happily take that. What? How did that go in? Like I should have had that ball seven times there. Ah, <sighs> this is so for like fine. Already should have had it there. Here I should have had it, but he like stops it at the right moment. And then again, you know, my my defenders cannot head. Like Lukaku, you're like. 20 meters behind him and you're making a jump to head what is that what is that okay let's take this with Shane I'm just gonna shoot directly at goal uh, I wanted to do it low but it didn't work out almost in the rebound though giving it to Agassi he needs to score this how do you not get a shot off 
Yunus now. This is gonna be my last opportunity and he doesn't get it. In. Okay, well, we didn't win and that is very bad because that means that if Feyenoord won their match, they are gonna gain two points on us. And I don't wanna see that, but uh, frustrating match. We really should have gotten away with a win there, but it just wasn't potent enough with my second team here, honestly, and that cost me the match. Well, I guess I'll just do a bit more training then now and uh, see if I can get anyone up. Mm, nothing yet, but uh, they're getting closer to 80. And it's time for the semi-finals in the Europa League. Everybody We're playing against Valencia from Spain. Gonna be a tough op opponent, no but let's see if we can do well here anyway. That was the first half. No real chances yet, but I have been more offensive than Valencia, and I haven't really given anything away, so I'm happy with that at least. Now let's see if we can get a goal, because it would be great to get an away goal in this match. Oh, that is very poorly passed, but what an interception by Dykes. What a great, great tackle there to uh, prevent what surely could have been a goal for them. Free kick from a pretty dangerous position for Valencia. They take it and they score. Frustrating to give away a free kick and have them score from pretty much the first opportunity they got, but... That's well taken and Sidis has no chance there. And that's the match. Very frustrating to lose 1-0 here because I definitely feel like I was the better side and they only had that free kick. That was literally the only time they got dangerous. But to be honest, I never really threatened too much either. Anyway, if I can get a 2-0 win at home again, like I'll still go through, but I would have liked an away goal, honestly. I really would have. Even though we've already done three matches this episode, I want to do the second leg against Valencia this episode too. So let's get into it and finish this match off in a good fashion with a win here. Oh no, Fuguli is true here. Let's make Silesia come out and... Oof, that almost went in. Okay, let's take this free kick with Milik. Uh, last time around I tried to shoot it low and I don't think I want to do that again. So I'm going to like... Try to curl it over and oh, hit the crossbar. That is very close. And in the rebound, El Ghazi can't get it in. Out here to Milik. Back into Fischer. And he is just body checked away there. That is a clear penalty. But he doesn't get carded. But look at that from Parejo. Like he just pushes Fischer. Like the ball isn't even at Fischer's feet anymore. Gonna take this with Milik. I really want to score this because I have not been doing too great on penalties so let's see there we go that's the one nil as it goes now we are going into extra time so we need another goal to really go through without extra time and I'm gonna see if I can make that happen and that should be the end of the first half we've been playing pretty well so far I think we can score the second goal and go through to the final which would be a good result especially against Valencia they've been good defensively but offensively They've been surprisingly weak. I, I really expect more danger from them. Uh, to Goodell, you know. What can we do, though? Oh, we get past our man. We get past inside again. And then we take a shot. But, oh, a penalty? Wow, okay, this is this is huge. Let's see what happened here. Bre okay, he comes sliding in, doesn't get the ball, and just gets Goodell, yeah. It's after the shot, but still, you can't make a foul like that in the box. Gonna take it with Milik again. Come on. Right side now. And it's in. That's right, the 2 0 now and 2 1 on aggregate. And if we can keep it up for five more minutes, we are true to the Europa League final. Through two penalties from Milik, I will take that any day. This is probably the final free kick of the game for Valencia. Parejo behind the ball. He just blasts that into the box and someone even gets his head on it. Was that Negredo? That had... Oh no, he gets his foot on it. Like a scorpion kick there. From Andre Gomez. Wow, that would have been some 2-1 by them. And that would have put them through too on away goals. That would have been amazing for them. But I'm very happy that it didn't go in. And I'm going to just blast this forward and hope the ref blasts his whistle too. 
He doesn't quite yet though. Sisto here. Okay, there we go. That's the whistle and we're true to the final of the Europa League. This is very, very great news. And uh, ah, it's going to be fun to play that next episode. And we get another 1.5 million to our budget. But that is going to do it for this episode. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you want to see more, then do subscribe to my channel down below and leave a thumbs up while you're there because next time is going to be the finale of season one. See you then.